Isn't that all the thing in our surrounding, like their existence shown, the existence of a superior power, of a self-sufficient, of a high creative mind, do you know? Yes, in fact, it's showing. And how it's showing? Let's come to know about that. So guys, well, if we see in our surrounding, like we are human beings, are we supposed to take our example? We without our basic needs, which are food, which is water, which is air, and which is proper light to be exposed to, and which is proper surrounding. Without that, no possibility of human existing. So how is it possible that everything others, like the trees, are we take their example? These trees can't actually walk, can't run, can't actually do a job, can't ask for money from somebody, can't ask from somebody for food, but the trees are better than us and their growth, their strength, their power and everything. How is it possible? Have we seen? internally and dig into the science we will find the fact scientifically basically it's showing us a kind of creativity of someone which is quite unique and who's that a superior power which is very backed by his degree and that's Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala like the plants they are using our exhale ear that's our inhale ear means we are inhaling the ear okay oxygen that's our exhale ear. We are making out from our body. That's exhale ear. Where that's going? That's going to the plant. And that's helping the plants. That's one of the basic need of plant. Okay? And that plant and then producing as a byproduct oxygen for us. And that's oxygen we are inhaling by our own self. That's just due to these trees. Okay? That's that's a unique system like the Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and that's why barely and laterally Apai said that the Allah is superior so that's why as creation is also unique nobody can make that kind of creation so dig in a little bit look toward the plant so how the plant are getting their basic needs so if we see the roots of the plant or basically absorbing the water from the soil and also this uh, the the uh, stem of the plants having a sucking power so they are snatching that water uh, pulling that water up hell you know to the leaf of the plant and a small leaf which having some nerves like structure you know and these nerves having a great creativity like they are doing evaporation these water when get um, a lot more than going outside of that plant because the more thing is not good even for the human because they can destroy internally the human body by the way, so the plants are actually exposing to them the light, and then light is coming. That's one also the basic need, just like the wet water, the food, and the ear. These all are important for a human, just the way that's important for the for the plants as well. So the plants are getting that carbon dioxide then that's actually sunlight then observing through the roots the water the minerals and these all are going to the leaf and combiningly they are forming so the process of photosynthesis get into existence so i'm telling you then the plants is growing up then the plants are making a kind of progression a kind of development and isn't there something um, unique in fact it is unique and if we see that's showing us the existence of a creator so I'm actually preaching to all of you about Islam every time and you people had to come just to know that the most honest to be honest the one that which is courteous toward you the one which loves you the one which wanna see you successful the one which wanna uh, make you to be grow up to help other people to self actualize that who you are okay that's your Allah that's your creator and at the day of judgment if you did something good with in that world you're going to get reward for it so i hope that was a helpful video for all of you and a prank for me and for my side for now assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa